Hi folks, welcome to my garage. Here I am building RV12. Uh, today we are going to do the project. It's a fuel tank leak test. We have to test the leak before we install the fuel tank. Took me a month to build the tank. This is the most challenging part of the building process. Uh, before we test the tank, the process is we have to airtight all the openings. There are four openings in the, um, the tank. One is fuel filler. The another one here, the blue one is air vent. This one is air vent. We need to tidy that too. Uh, I tied that with the fittings came with it. And there is another two in the bottom, which is fuel supply and return so this one right here in fuel supply side i put the balloon there so balloon is there and the other side return side we're gonna put the shredder bulb like this so we can put the ear through that when we put the ear the balloon should expand When the balloon expands, then we leave it that way for 24 hours. If it, it, it holds the air, tank is good. If it lost, lose the air, then we can have a leak. So before do that, we put the air, we need to check our compressor. Compressor has to be very low setting. If you set in high, it's going to explode this tank is a little we need very little air for that and i'm going to test it with the um, bubble soap here is the tank compressor is set in lowest possible to avoid explode the tank and let's try to put the air through the spreader now we are ready for the air here is my son, he is watching what I'm doing. He wants to build the plane when he grew up. He's only seven right now and by the 20, I guess he wants to build too. Let's put the ear here. Once we put the ear through the shredder, it should expand slowly by itself. Let's wait and see. it's coming there you are yeah see how it ex expands let me let's make it a little bit bigger there it is now it's pretty good size now we are going to wait for 24 hour and see if it holds see i have a see marcel my son wants to try to do the soap leak test we're gonna spray the soapy water there if there is any obvious big leaks you can see the bubbles right away uh, i'll spray the soapy everywhere to see the obvious leak if there is a big leaks you can see right away so far it looks good i worked pretty hard to build this tank it took me a month the goop we use for the tank man it's so messy it's I, it's crazy i hate this part you know the total building process i didn't like the tank process at all but it is what it is and i have done it it looks good everything looks good not there is no any obvious look i mean leak but we still have to wait for 24 hours. We'll wait and see what it does. This is a pretty good uh, good practice. I have been build, building this plane for a year in my garage. It's a very small place to build the garage. But you know, it is still work. I do not like to rent the hangar from now because going, hand, going to hangar and coming back is like a whole hour. I don't think I can do as much as work in hangar 
that what I do in my garage. In garage, five five in the morning, I wake up. I couldn't sleep. I just to go to the garage and do my work. So that's how I have been doing. So far, it's almost there. This is October right now, and I order my engine already. By the end of this year, I am gonna finish the project and january 2018 i have planned to fly this plane and let's see how it goes everything is going good so far building coming right my son helps a lot he's only seven man and he this guy helped me everywhere everything hopefully he will he is learning a lot and by the time he's 20 he can do a lot better all right, let's come back after 24 hours and see. Okay, let's come back. Here is the balloon. Balloon haven't lose any ear. So it looks pretty good to me. He tells me the tank is, there is no leak at tank. That's how we do the test. Now it's ready to install. Hey, thank you for watching. Please do not forget to like, share and subscribe my channel. I will load more videos in future. Thanks again.